That's a good lead in. Thank you. Before you said it, I'll say it for myself. But uh, I am principal of the high school, and I am very honored and proud to work with a lot of our fellows here in the room and with Jennifer. She's done an outstanding job with this uh, cohort of leaders, of teachers, administrators, superintendents, instructional supervisors. Um, my, and I, I have uploaded, I think all of our capstones are uploaded on the holiday, but my capstone project was a student uh, lounge, uh, if you will, for lack of a better term, for our school. And we have a we have a 11 year old school that looks brand new. Looks like we just opened it last year. But we have an upstairs uh, part right off of our teachers' lounge. It's a huge hallway that is just empty. Students hardly ever are in that area. It's close to our elevator. So I cre I, I took a picture of it. Somebody asked me, "So what'd you do? Buff the floor right before?" I said, "No, it's because it showed there's no traffic in that area." So what I did was I challenged our student leadership team, and we call it our principal's cabinet. It's our, we have five representatives from all grade levels, so we have freshmen through senior uh, represented on this, and I said, this is what I want you to do. It is yours. I want you to create something that's going to be yours. You'll have the ownership of it. Not only that you will have the use of it, but it will actually be something you created. So that is what we've done. We've met with them. I met with them initially, gave them, gave them the charge. This is what I want you to do. And then they have met a couple times to say, they have met a couple times to, to basically, as a group, to work on looking at research, looking at different areas, or looking at different student lounges uh, from different sites and or from uh, sources. I know Jennifer has shared a couple things with me that I've forwarded on to them. Uh, our librarian, Mrs. Brown, has met with them once just to kind of uh, corral them a little bit, but that is, it's an ongoing project. My goal was to have it up by the end of October and be ready to go. We haven't got there yet. Uh, but that is what we're looking at. It's something that they can create, that they could go and actually spend time, whether it be during lunch, during break, uh, or even an out, a hallway classroom that a teacher wouldn't be able to bring a class out to sit there with, a, with their students. But the goal was for it to be a student-designed and student-use space. And the kids were kind of excited because they were like, wow, we get to design something ourselves and then we get to actually use it. So that is our project. That is my project. I say ours because it is student-led and it is student-initiated. Just like this morning's, uh, you know, with our choir performing and then our students leading the session this morning, I think that's what we're all getting to is we want our students to actually take the lead in our school and especially with the learning that's taking place. So that's, that's what I have. Uh, comments or questions or... And if you're late, you have to pay a dollar. <laughs> and if you want me to repeat what I say, it would take me 30 seconds and I can do it. So. But, uh, any questions? Or uh, I, don't have, actually, I don't have anything, but it is on the hall. I've got a picture of the, the space that we are designing. Thank you. All right.